Today we're launching the opening of our Dementia Assessment Board here in the Waterside Hospital. We know that um, patients with dementia sometimes have to come into hospital and sometimes they find it very traumatic. Um, it's important that the environment is conducive to their needs and we had got a, a design audit done on our ward um, to see if how it met the needs of um, people with dementia. The outcome of that was that uh, we needed to uh, improve the environment for people with, with dementia, particularly around the space, um, the lighting, the colour scheme, the furnishings, um, the layout of the ward to provide the uh, patients with dementia more space to be able to um, move about um, and be able to identify spaces that they um, require, such as their bedrooms, their bathrooms, um, the lounge, the dining room, um, this, the whole issue around the furnishings and making sure that the environment was conducive to their needs, that they could navigate the environment, that it was homely um, and friendly, and so it would be as least traumatic for people with dementia coming under the environment from their home. The other part of the Dementia Design Audit was identifying um, the actual what we actually done in the ward for patients when they come under the unit and what therapies we, we offered them and what type of environment would be conducive to therapies for people with dementia and how we could support people to be discharged home early and maybe prevent people from coming into hospital unnecessarily. So we also incorporated into the design a new therapeutic hub. This has also been designed to dementia standards and we have been linking with um, Dementia Design Centre um, to make sure that it did reach the dementia standard. Um, we have now within the ward as well, we have therapeutic rooms, um, activity rooms, uh, a library where we're hoping to get um, IT equipment done for patients as well. So the whole focus will be on well-being um, and rehabilitation where we can. We have new staff coming to the hub as well. We have a psychology input, OT, nurse and therapeutic assistant um, and their challenge will be on a daily basis to run therapeutic interventions for patients with dementia and also um, what we plan to run, uh, which will be starting in the next coming weeks, is education programs for people with dementia and their families following diagnosis for, from our memory clinic.